Hello and welcome to free VBA tips. Today we are going to see how we can automatically generate legal aid letters on a click. So if I click on this print button, it is going to generate a legal letter which we can customize as per our choice. So it is working and once we click on OK, we'll get the letter as this. We can cust completely customize the letters depending on the requirement. So let us see how the automation work and then we will um, be create our own letter and then make changes in it. So when you will extract the file, you will uh, get these three folder, two folders and one file like this. This is the main file which we have to run and to create the letters. The template contains the template that we are going to amend and then the export file contains all the letters that we have generated so far. So let us see how this automation works. We go here to the template file and open it. There are few text that is defined in hash and at the rate p. So let us understand how these works. The text which is in hash, ha hash and hash, like county or the state, that is going to be replaced by the Excel file. So we come back to the Excel file here. So you see first name, middle name, last name. So we will see first name, middle name, and the last name. Now we will see what this makes sense, PL. So, if we want this in a proper case, then we have to put at the rate P. If we want that in a lower case, then we have to put L, similarly L, and this is for P for proper case. If there is a at the rate U, it means this should be in upper case. So, there are three cases. First is lower, upper, and proper. Similarly over here we have these values like this one first name middle name like that so it is going to replace that so let me just take more values over here Robert John Jike Mike Pike so for example this person doesn't have a middle name so we can just remove this if we click we if we remove this x from here and try printing the letter it will say value missing so to make the value as non-mandatory we have to put a x like this and then print it so there will be two letters generated mike and john you see the status bar it is working and this sheet name as general affidavit is the actual the file actually the file name if we rename this one this file will get renamed the file which we are printing right now so this one is printed so let us see mike now you will see that there is no middle name over here So it prints both the files in a X in a Word and the PDF so that we can modify in case we want to. So we have to check box over here. So I would suggest that uh, you always check Word because that is the initial version so that we can easily modify the files. So let us create a letter for ourselves using some template so let us add few more values over here so I will just take a backup of this one and then add at the rate at the rate manager name or say at the rate hash lawyer name and we want that in uppercase so at the rate u and then we put hash. So we copy this 
and we paste it over here. Now a new field is added which is a lawyer name and let me just make it as red and save this. This is an uppercase so that we have to keep in mind and let us add one more field as notary name. So we just copy here. Hash. Now we have to remove the at the rate from here. So it should be like this. Now we'll click on print and it is printing the letter. letter is printed and we click on OK then there is one letter with the mic and you will see that Rahul Jake and Kalia is written here in red and then the other one should also show something Aman and Rahul so this is in red so I want to change it so I'll go to the basic template template open it and then choose everything and then make it uh, automatic so right now this is an uppercase and I want to make this in proper case so I'll just put P over here at the rate P and now I'll print the letter again so now I should see the text in black and then there should be a proper case Alright, so letter has been generated. We open the letter and you see Rahul Jake and Kalia is in proper case. So that's how we can pri print a letter, a legal letter and there can be a number of letters that you can print. So you can download this automation from the description link and for similar kind of videos you can subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.